This is a British Armed Forces Single Meal Ration Pack, or the SMR. And this is the British Armed Forces 24 Hour Ration Pack General Purpose. The SMR weighs 1 pound 13.9 ounces, or 849 grams, while the 24 Hour General Purpose weighs 3 pounds 5.4 ounces, or 1,515 grams. The SMR contains 1,500 calories, while the 24 hour general purpose has 4,000. This thing comes in 10 different menus pork sausage casserole. Depending on the mission, between two or three are issued per day. A lot of times it's used on training missions or on long-range reconnaissance patrol missions where pack weight reduction is essential. Okay, so we're off the bat. There's your FRH, flameless ration heater. These are not included on the 24-hour general purpose. They're issued separately, or you eat them cold or boil it in the pouch. Look at that. Here's your accessory pack, or brew kit. Get a pack of tissues. That's really nice. Strong mint sugar-free gum with sweeteners. Standard ORP spork. Three-in-one instant coffee. That's in a new package. Look at that. It's a tough tri-laminate pack. Not bad. Two alcohol-free antibacterial wipes. You get the same amount in this SMR with this and the pack of tissues as an entire ORP. Then a three in one tea. Ziploc bag, that's real nice for storing any loose components or trash. Okay. Biscuits brown. Oh wow, look at this. Mixed fruit snack. It's like a fruit smoothie with a built-in gusset. 90 grams. Apple mango banana flavor. Fortified energy drink powder. Refreshing strawberry flavor. Oh, wow. You get two of those. Cookies and cream flavor bar. Here's some jam. Plum jam. Here's the main sausage casserole. That's looking pretty good for a single meal. Alright, let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. Okay, let's first start off by heating up that main. This thing. Looks like it's pretty heavy duty. Check that out. It's got a tear notch at the top there. Let like this down at the bottom. There we go. Just a tiny bit more. Do the trick. Let's check out that coffee. Hmm, that smells like a latte just right out of the pack. Wow, 
Look at that. Nice. Light coffee. They put a lot of creamer in there. Now for the three in one tea. You'll see the same three in one tea in the British cold climate rations. It's real good stuff. Check out that granule. Doesn't smell like anything. Not really. That looks like a nice mug of tea right there. Time to check out that fortified energy drink powder, refreshing strawberry. It's the tear notch. There it is. Wow, look at that. It has extract of turmeric, vitamin B1. That's nice. B1, thiamine. Gotta have it. Hmm. I need to smell that right away. Check that out. Gosh, that smells like a strawberry popsicle. Hmm, that's mouthwatering. Wow, there's a slight a little bit of a library smell. Like chalky, like chlorine. Intense. Okay, let's go ahead and check out that cookies and cream flavored bar. Mm. Quite the appearance. Hmm, that has a brilliant, like, fruit, cocoa, and grain smell. And it's not too sticky to touch. Seems like they've improved it. Biscuits Brown is back in town. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, they're, they're nice and fresh, that's always a plus. The Plum Jam. Let's give this a look on its own. Oh, wow. Hmm. A tart, rich, velvety sweet with a very smooth texture and consistency. The viscosity to this jam, I think it could be a little bit thicker, but then it wouldn't be as spreadable. Heck, you don't even have to spread it. Squeeze it right out. Do this. Oh yeah. Let's go ahead and have some biscuits brown with tea. Biscuits brown on its own. Is a tried and true wheat, bran, and oat biscuit with a surprising amount of sweetness and a very satisfying crunch with hydrogenated vegetable oil instead of like butter. So it's not exactly buttery, but the fact it has fat content and a little bit of salt. And they're very dunkable biscuits. Mm. Great for between eight and 10 ounces, the portion size. 
makes for a good half mug of tea. It's smooth, rich, and it's not overly sweet. A little bit bitter, which again means it's strong. It's Oops. Great thing about that big old spork. Wow. Hmm. That's some of the best tea that you can get in a ration right there. That three in one British ration tea. Here. Let's go ahead and have some biscuits brown on jam with the tea. Talk about decadence. Mm. The biscuit, its flavor, well baked with a light malt, again, somewhat sweet, and a prevalent bran, along with wheat and oat. Biscuits brown, been around for 50 years too. Recipes pretty much been the same. They seem a little more brittly than they used to be, but that's about it. Not bad. Portable fruit smoothie. Look at that. Hmm. A lot of water and sugar. Mango and banana prevalent. The apple is the primary fruit in it, but still for flavor. Really getting mango. This is amazing. If you were out of water, still had this I'd save it for last really easy to say you'd have some real discipline for saving that any longer than an hour it could really come in handy for a quick energy boost and to rehydrate you slightly at least you know a 90 grams and whatever is not water is sugar and it's gonna provide a good amount of metabolic water if you include the smoothie, it technically has four beverages. This thing would be great for cold climates or in a hot climate where the additional fluid intake is recommended and encouraged. Let's check this out. Cookies and cream. A very rich cocoa flavor. I will say, a bit dry. It's not overly sweet. It has a light fruit flavor. Primarily chocolate with Rice Krispies crunch. It's a dry, crunchy, crispy, somewhat thirst-provoking chocolate bar or energy bar that seems to have some protein, possibly a soy protein crisp, along with rice puffs, and again, quite a bit of cocoa. Mm. Followed up with some coffee. The coffee is outstanding. It's smooth, bold, sweet and creamy goes great with this bar, which is dry and a little bit underwhelming in its flavor, actually. But it's still not bad. It's time to check out that main. That thing is piping hot. pretty good. So you get three sausages. Soft, melt in your mouth, mild. Oh wow, that is delectable. That's... Hmm. 
a nice tomato sauce that is creamy and mild. It's almost like a tomato bisque. It's like buttery. Oh, wow. You can skewer the sausage with your spork. Hmm. Light smoked flavor. This would be great for breakfast. You could eat it any time of the day. Look at that. Peas. Little cubes of potato. Carrot. It's pretty much like a, a stew. This is perfection. Mm. Good amount of fat, great flavor. That's nice cubes of potato. They're not mushy. A British comfort food classic, pork sausage casserole. Throw in some of this biscuits brown, the beverage base. Nice and light. Light in food coloring too, just enough. In case it was treated water that's already a little bit dark, you could maybe offset some of the unpleasantness of that. Great flavor. And a lot of electrolytes. A very nice and natural strawberry flavor to it. And it's not overly sweet. And the biscuits brown with plum jam. Great combination, goes hand in hand. Gotta keep up on your calorie intake. Wow, Biscuits Brown adds a nice additional layer of flavor and then crunch. The strong mint chewing gum. Firm chew. Hmm. Oh wow. That's a very strong peppermint and spearmint. That really does the trick. Gets your saliva glands going, cleans your teeth. Excellent gum. This thing is pretty much just as good as the USMRE. More toilet paper. Too large moist towelettes instead of the one wet nap. Let's check this out by the way. They give you that pack of tissues and then two of these. This is nice. Look at that. You could clean yourself with this. Reusable. So this was the British Armed Forces SMR or single meal ration pack. Pork sausage casserole. A nutritionally balanced ration with an excellent FRH that might not have as long a shelf life as the USMRE. It's two years instead of three on an inspection, but still has a good shelf life. And rugged. This thing could get air dropped. Not bad. Well, anyway, this is Steve1989. I hope you liked the video. And I'll be coming back at you with something new. Or old. Alright, cool. See ya.